it was church like it was so quiet in here. There were so many Red Sox fans. And are they going to rule that how what are they going to rule here now Rayburn came out looked like he was about to rule a balk. But was time granted. And no pitch looked like time was granted. Yeah he was ready to call a balk. But. Porcello had stopped because time was called. Well, the umpire never really gave the timeout sign. Well, he was just about to rule Bach, wasn't yeah, he? Yeah, he was. He was confused. I mean, you know, <laughs> unless he vocally said time, there was no motion that he called time. Now, in any event, no pitch. <laughs> now, you can see Morrison right now talking with Raber and the home plate umpire. The umpire is explaining to him. You know you can't be you can't be doing that. I mean, I I got to call time. You just can't walk out of the box like that. If I don't call time, you can't do that. And that's exactly what the discussion is right now. Well, John Farrell and Carl Willis keeping it cool because they have just set the runners back, Forsyth back to second, and Longoria to first. Now you know it's interesting they're on the phone in the Red Sox dugout you think they might be looking to see if that was a strike. This this is crazy. I just found it fascinating that Rayburn was coming out he was starting to point at Porcello like that's a balk and then he waved himself off like no 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 I've changed my mind. It's simply going to be no pitch. A bizarre play. We've already had a couple of them here in tonight's game. And at first he was advancing the runners, and he told them to stop. Yeah, Morris is going. What's the call? Man, 